three trailers week times sixty dollars a trailer. That is a hundred and eighty dollars. So your total for fifty two weeks gross annual will be seventy nine thousand ninety two dollars. And that fifteen hundred and twenty one dollars a week gross. What's up, YouTube? Welcome back to Breaking Truckers. You wanted to be in the game, right? Now you're in the game. Listen, um, I know I talk about the dollar accounts all the time. Now Dollar General seems to have their own fleet. Now, I was trying to reach out to them to get some information for you guys on how to uh, jump on this fleet, but all this information about the Dollar General fleet is all online. And I think after you fill out the application and all that other good stuff, I think that's when they will reach out to you to further the application and the onboarding process. But again, like I said, I'm, I'm, I'm just going to break it down to you guys so you guys can understand where Lockout Men is coming from when it comes to the dollar accounts. It's a bit fact zero for me, period. Okay, I did not spend all that money to be a laborer. Basically, that's what it is. They, they want a truck driver and a laborer combined. I can't do that. No more wasting time. Let's get it. Hold on. I managed to uh, talk to a young lady. She started the Warner Dollar account uh, next week. And after, you know, being there for a while, she agreed to come on with me and chop it up about uh, what's going on with uh, Warner Dollar account. But I just want to bring I just want to bring this information to you guys to catch you guys up on what to expect from the warner dollar account all right so check it out check it out this is the information after uh hired on so dollar general uh this particular account is out of oklahoma home weekly for a minimum of 34 hours see that's another thing too that the trucking industry take full advantage of like bro you work a full 70 hour week and you only get a day and and a minute off to yourself well aren't you supposed to get like at least a couple of days off like if you work monday through friday you get saturday and sunday off and you come back on monday if you work uh uh say like tuesday through saturday you get sunday and monday off you at least get two days off right but in the trucking industry nah nah we'll make sure you're home for your 34 hour reset no that's not my reset that's federally mandated reset that's the federally mandated truck not moving reset not for me i get two days off i gotta reset i got things to do i got i got stuff to be taken care of on my off days and 34 hours from the time now mind you from the time the truck stops until that 34 hour is up and that 34 hour could be up at any time it could be up in the middle of 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 sunday it could be in the at midnight monday morning you see where i'm going with this but anyway let's let's you know sorry about that let's continue average weekly payout is 15 hundred and twenty one dollars with top performers earning 103k annually 
guarantee weekly pay of a thousand dollars first two weeks on the account to qualify you must be available for the full work week let me stop the show a thousand dollars a thousand dollars bro don't you know you you're, you're a day laborer once you once you get to the dollar store you gotta you gotta set up after you set up you gotta unload and you only guarantee a thousand dollars bro i'm just saying home weekly for a minimum of 34 hours 100 percent driver unloads let me repeat that and let me let me holler this for the people in the back because it seems like the people in the back can't hear it let me tell you 100 percent driver unload but hey listen i listen let me stop the show again i tell you 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 probably could get over on that by bringing a writer see when you get on with uh warner you know us express all these companies that does the dollar accounts make see if they can um see if they have a writer policy you see what i'm you, you see where i'm going with that you see where i'm going with that see if you can get a writer to ride would you you could probably get that additional help and you can probably pay that guy or that female or your kid out of that thousand dollars guaranteed that you getting you probably could give them about maybe about a hundred two hundred dollars just to help you unload think about that uh the running lanes uh out of this oklahoma uh account is texas arkansas kansas city colorado and of course oklahoma you will have 48 rotundas or re rotainers in a fully loaded trailer and they will average about 15 to 20 rotainers per store average 15 to 20 totes floor loaded driver will load into u boats and push them into the store 100 percent of loads will have toppers hand loaded into u-boats also mentorship will take place in the mentee's truck mentee will be paid for two hundred dollars mentee will be paid the mileage and unload pay does that uh does that sound good to you guys so far let's continue uh mentee all drivers must do smith training and backing class prior to joining so you already know that you're going to be backing in some of these crazy ass places you're going to be backing in some shopping centers you're going to be backing in the standalone stores you're going to be backing in the ghetto the ghetto because that's where some of these dollar stores is at i'm just saying but then again but then again you know i've seen some dollar generals is like coming up though like they 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 own store and they have a dock i don't know what's what's going on with dollar general but hey but i'm just saying some of these places that you're going to be getting into yeah it's going to test your backing it's gonna test you. If you can't handle it, you just can't handle it. But it's gonna test you though. Backup cameras are given to all drivers with zero 90 days experience upon request. What's a backup camera gonna do? Huh? I mean, if I'm in a if I'm in a car, I would love to have a backup camera in a car, but What's a backup camera going to do in the semi? Really? I mean, it could help. Don't get me wrong. It could help. You know, if you bobtailing, it's, it's awesome. I, you know, I've seen some backup cameras in the semi. 
and it, it it's pretty it's it's a pretty good view you know make a little youtube video out of it but like using it in real world action i ah, i don't know i don't know all right let's continue if you feel you need one all you have to do is request it through your fleet manager all right so let's break down the let's break down the pay so 1800 miles times 62 cent per mile equals one thousand one hundred and sixteen dollars you got 10 stops per week at twenty two dollars and fifty cent that'll be two hundred and twenty five dollars three trailers week times sixty dollars a trailer that is a hundred and eighty dollars so your total for 52 weeks gross annual will be $79,092 and that $1,521 a week gross so does that sound good this is the dollar account for Warner out of Oklahoma so if you guys good with that warner's looking for you but i'm just saying for me personally it's a no-go